Hi guys, it's David here from One Step at a Time. In today's video, uh, I was going to show you how to tell what motherboard version you have. The reason I'm doing this is because I was updating my motherboard, so just I'll quickly do a video on it. Um, there's a couple of different ways. First way is command prompt, so just press Windows X. Uh, it might come up as PowerShell because it's default in Windows 10. To run command, you can either type in CMD here or you can change it by going into Windows Settings, Personalization, Taskbar, and in here, replace command prompt with the shell. You just take that off, and when you press Windows X now, it'll come up there. Just press command prompt, and you just type in here. Um, once you press WMIC baseboard get, if you hit enter, it'll give you all the information. If you want version, just type in version. If you want the manufacturer, type in manufacturer. You can type it all in if you like. Uh, and comma, and you can put in manufacturer. But if you just press get, it'll give you all the information. Um, in here, then it'll tell you. Now it's saying all of my stuff is to be filled by OEM, which isn't going to help me. So I know I'm going to end up having to go into my BIOS. But for you, this might have worked. And um, the other option is to just press Windows R. You just go MS Info 32 and hit enter. And all this information will come up here. So it'll tell you it's 978, TS3P, it's Gigabyte. But it's still not telling me the baseboard version. Now in Gigabyte, on the motherboard itself, inside your, on the bottom left hand corner, I uh, have it saved here to show you. On the left hand side, bottom left, see this reference? That's 2.0. But mine says 2.1, but it still doesn't match. So when you go into the BIOS, it'll show you exactly what references version it is it'll even give you the version ID so um, we'll do that next now you just need to restart your PC so hit the restart when you get the prompt either if a delete whatever it is on your system to get into the BIOS once you're in here then it'll show you on the front screen first screen but if you want you can go and just click on system information and that'll give you all the info you need so as you can see mine's FD which wasn't showing up when we tried the other options so um hope you liked the video if you do hit the like subscribe and I will catch you in the next one. Cheers bye